Today began with me drinking at 6.30 in the morning in order to empty out a bottle to use for water. I promise I don't have a problem, but if you do, here you go. It's a good day. Outside, I saw about half a dozen zombies across the street. What are you doing over there, you silly goose? I went back toward the car wreck I discovered yesterday, whereupon I discovered a group of loiterers. But since trespassing is legal, I got to sentencing. Guilty, 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 guilty! You got something stuck in your leg, chief. I don't think so. Am I just gonna reach through the window and grab some kitchen tongs? Hello? This is the home inspector. Hello? Monsieur? Are you aware there is a zombie banging on your door? Don't worry. I will save you. This house has been cleared. 9.30 in the morning and I'm already drowsy. So I'm gonna take a quick power nap. <laughs> After the nap, I sat on the couch, ate a banana, then went on to the next house. I'm sneaking up on ya. Watches. Something that unites all Kentuckians. I checked my weight and saw that it was on the decline, which meant things were going according to plan. 99. Look at me. Another house was looted, and another bag of loot was brought back to the base. I saw a group of zombies on my way back, but decided to ignore them for now. After dropping off the loot, I decided to head west, where I saw another car wreck and some more vehicles in a parking lot. Moving south, I saw another house to be looted. The only troubling thing inside was that there was a leak in their refrigerator. Squid? Don't think I've seen that before. But otherwise, just non-perishable food. The house next door had some metalworking equipment, as well as some water bottles in the refrigerator. On my way home, I took everything of value out of the police bull driver. Somewhat overburdened, I should be fine, as long as I don't come across any zombies. Hello, motherfucker! I dropped the gas can and the guns to make the fighting easier. I went inside to organize the goods, then went back outside to begin removing the interlopers. Not two. Sufficiently tired, I opted to go back inside the house, but not before regathering my guns to bring inside with me. Now, my M9 pistol had a friend, as well as a rifle to keep the baseball bats company. I ate an apple, refilled my water bottle, and went to bed.